in previous video i have shown how you can start download install the resoft sql 11.0 software now in this video i'll let you know what are the features and how to configure this software so the first i'll go with the features this software has all the features available in online real soft software this means all the features available in real time web software everything is available here instead of mobile apps means in this software you are not going to use use any mobile app but in this software you have all the options all company branch department designation everything much more options in cat category and office time policy as permit late early condition on working hour everything is these are the options also available in real soft desktop software but in this everything is at one place and also it has the major feature of this is access control option and sms option means if you are going to use this software you don't have to go with any other software before when you are using the desktop software for attendance you you are using real soft 10.7 or 10.8 for access control you have to go with real soft access control software and for sms you have to go to real soft auto sms software but for now here you don't have to go with those other different different software you just download this software and get all the features available everything is here you can send your in out absent late sms from here from access control you can create your on time zone their validity reports access access report everything is everything and even you can also read and write the database from this software in the next video i'll show you how you can access the database of this software so for now let's go with how to configure this software so after the installation the first step what we have to do is we have to create company branch department designation shift holiday holiday is not mandatory but if you want you can create at first time then machine setup category category is name as office time policy leave master then employee details so for now let's start from company master put your company name it's not mandatory to provide the description so i'll just make this description also as my company name make it save close then go to department master put the same as department software address not mandatory close if you have multiple branches you can add them to delhi delhi make it save okay close now go to designation designation basically is the post on which employees works description as mean not mandatory i'll make it blank save okay multiples save okay close then go to shift master general shift it already created if you want to change you can put your timing if you have any break you can put the break timing this is remove duplicate punch this is within an hour if you are doing multiple punches it will calculate only the first punch maximum early hours allowed this means 
before 10 you are allowed to come two hours early maximum ot hours allowed this means after six you are allowed six hours to stay this one is number of present for week off this means if you are putting it four or three two whatever this means if you are present for four days in a week then you are eligible for getting week off else your week off will be considered as absent from here you can select your week off if you have any second week off just like mine is second saturday and fourth saturday and the second week off is full so just select that if you have any half day shift then you can select that half day shift from here but before that you will need to create an half day shift then ot calculation working hour calculation first and last out or all in out or first and last out with lunch or mark as absent as week off as wow this means if you are absent before and after the week off then if you make it check here your week off will be calculated as absent same with leave if you are on leave before and after if you are on leave before and after a week off then your week off will be considered as leave make it just make it save if you have any another shift you can create don't forget to make it three characters put your timing I'll just make it 10 minutes only. No any issue, no week off, no nothing. Just save. Once done, make it close. Holiday master. I'm not going to do it right now. But if you want, you can make it. Now go to machine setup. Machine setup is quite updated because in previous softwares, whenever we were adding machines, we need to see what's our machine model number. So now in this, you don't have to figure it out. Just see whether the machine is finger or face or it's a controller. Don't have multiple machines just finger face or controllers put your machine number select your machine type put the serial number port number ip address connection mode lan p2s usb or divine dns and if you want to use autopus then you will need to put the server ip as your this system's ip in device and use port 7788 for finger devices the same for face devices use host pc ip or manager pc ip of this system and put 5005 as host pc port now just make it save now it's a category category means policy office time policy in the real in the real time web software is mentioned so i'll just make it general now the first thing is permit late arrival this means we are allowing that you can come 10 minute late after 10 minute it will be considered as late okay then mark as half day working hour is less than if your working hour is less than four hours it will consider as half day not going to do this absent if your working hour is less than two hours it will be considered as absent now late arrival allowed 
before going to this option i'll let you come this option this is after 10 minutes it will be considered as late but if you enable it from here this means after every fourth late means every fourth late of the month will be considered as half day you are means you are late on first you are late on third you are late on fourth then on five it's half day again you are late on six you are late on seven you are late on eight you are late on ten it's half day this is for late arrivals and this is for daily means if you are coming two hours late it will directly cut half day doesn't matter whether it's your first late second late third late fourth late whatever if you if you are two hours late you will be half day same with this if you are going one hour early or two hour early it will be count as half day if you want to ignore some overtime you can put that time here i'm not going to do that so just make it save close now category is done leave master leave master this leave master in the sense you have to just create your leave code so i'll just create cl casual leave oops i forgot to mention week off will be included it's a paid leave holiday includes leave carry forward now go to employee master here you have to put your employee name employee name employee code is a serial number one two three four five you can put anything card number is your biometric id i think we haven't created department yet so let's just see okay software save close employee master select now software here employee code from here you can select the office time policy that is category shift from here week off automatically it will get if you have shifts in rotation then just select is auto shift and check in which which shift he can come select and save add another one C02 2 software companies here and make it save now when you are going to get the report you have to do nothing if data is coming automatically you have you, you have to directly go and get the report if you are not using auto post option then you will need to go to data transfer connect select the date download data then upload the data right now i don't have device connected so i'm not going to show that just connect download and upload after this you directly have to go and get the report in report it will show you whether it's in out absent present whatever it is here it will show start time in time out late out early working ot status remark everything it will show for now i'm just going to give a manual punch time insert okay 
now both two employees are present you can see from here once we have done the manual punch we can directly see whether the employee is present or not so if we go and get the report it will show whether the, they are available and there is miss punches but if you want to generate the shift means if you have done any changes in the shift then from generate shift you can generate their shift then from data process you can process their shift I'll just do it for first to till today to show you the monthly report close go to monthly report click on show report it will show you the monthly report in which in out shift late working hour OT status early 